Breaking news, a 14-year veteran of the Appleton Fire Department has died in the line of duty after a shooting. It happened around 5.30 last night on the 100 block of East Washington Street. That's the location of the Valley Transit Center. NBC26's Jennifer Nazza is live on the scene with the very latest for us. Jen? Good morning. As of now, we know one firefighter is dead, a police officer is injured, as well as two other civilians. Now, if you take a look, we're at the scene of where this happened at the Valley Transit Center in downtown Appleton, and you can see that there is still caution tape up. Police and squad cars are surrounding the perimeter of the crime scene, and there's still a ton to be investigated. We just learned that there was a procession for the firefighter's body in Milwaukee being transferred to the medical examiner's office. Now, Appleton police say at around 5.30 last night, authorities were called to the transit center off of Washington and Oneida Street in downtown Appleton for a medical-related incident. Police tell us what started out as a fairly routine, as a fairly routine call ended in tragedy. It's the same way that all of our jobs tend to work. Something happened. I don't know what happened, but ultimately a, a shooting did occur. The Appleton Fire Department says the police officer who was shot is now recovering at a local hospital and funeral arrangements are being made for the firefighter. The fire department tells us that this is still an ongoing investigation, so we will have more details for you to come. They are expected to make a statement later on this afternoon in a press conference, so stick with us and check our website, NBC26.com, for more updates. Reporting live in Appleton, Jennifer Nazza, NBC26, back to you.